Oh my, where'd you get that picture from? All right, uh, boys and girls. So I know that that's a really long, that's a little more wild of a, uh, a fun Munns pun session, but I'm gonna ask for a little bit more calm of a vibe because I wanna talk to you about something really important. On Monday, um, as many of you may be aware, um, the masking policy in our lower school will be changing where fully vaccinated students, shh. So I love that there was kind of a mixed response there because I think that is, uh, that we're all probably feeling different feelings about this. And some may be very excited and some may be feeling very different. And I wanna go through what this means. We've dealt with COVID for over two years and it's been a big change for all of us. And I love Passover and I totally forgot Purim was coming up, but I picked Passover as my, as my topic today. But just like the four sons in the Haggadah, I'm gonna talk about the four different children of Berman and they look a little bit like this, all right? So some of you might be unmasked and really excited about it. You've been waiting a long time for this, and I totally understand that. You know, I might feel like this way too, um, and I bet there's some of you that are really excited to take off your mask, and that makes a lot of sense, and I get that. And there might be others of you who are gonna be unmasking, but it's been a long time. You've been masking for, for about two years now, and this is a major change for you, especially for some of our younger friends who have really only been masked since they've been in our school. And this is a major change in being nervous. That might be really understandable too. And then there are some of us who are going to choose to or have to remain masked. And they are concerned because for the first time in a while, there are gonna be some unmasked friends around us. And that's a major change too, and that makes a lot of sense. And then finally, there are some people who, whether or not they're vaccinated or they have medical conditions or their parents are, or are wanting them to be extra careful, they may be a little bit annoyed that they still have to mask, and that's okay, I understand that. Um, and we have to follow that policy, and we're gonna follow that. And these are different feelings for different kids. And you may feel different one day or one week than you do in the future. And you may not fit into any of these four, and that's okay. This is a different experience and different feelings for a lot of us. But we expect all of you to follow these type of rules. The first one is respect privacy. Any of you who are vaccinated did not make that choice on your own. It had to do with your parents and your family. And just like those who are going to be masked, that's not a decision that they took lightly and that they made entirely on their own. So we want to respect the privacy of others. It is not appropriate to ask them why they're masked. If they're vaccinated, why they're not vaccinated, that is not your business and we want to be respectful of that. Finally, uh, second, I want you to include others. You're going to see different types of faces. Some of them are going to be masked, some of them are not going to be. Let's not pick who we're hanging out with and who we're greeting based on that. You know, this is a, we, we, there's a mitzvah to greet each, of, each, each and every one, and you can do that. Include your friends, greet them, show everybody the respect that they deserve, and finally show empathy. Just because you're feeling excited about it, and that's okay, or maybe you're feeling nervous about it, we have to respect the feelings of others. And I know that each one of you are capable of it. Uh, this week and, I'm, and also next week, I'm talking about being an ally. Raise your hand if you know what it's like to be an ally. If you don't, oh, that's a lot of hands, all right? We are gonna be an ally to all of our friends and all of our peers who are experiencing a big change on Monday. So if you're excited, great. If you're nervous, that's okay. We are gonna deal with this together, all right? Shabbat shalom, everyone.